Is this just a colored cola? They just call it Inca? We have to look this up. This is probably the most yellow pop or soft drink that I've actually had. <laughs> Even before I got to Peru, I've done a little bit of research like what to do, what to eat, where to go in Peru. One of the things that people talk on the internet that you actually have to try it at least once. Other things you might want to drink when you're here, oh my god, how can I forget, Inca Cola. That is the biggest drink here. My kids love it. My youngest one wakes up in the morning asking for Inca Cola. That's how much he likes it. It's this thing, Inca Cola. It's really a big thing here. It's like Inca Cola everywhere. Inca Cola. Inca Cola. <laughs> Inca Cola. 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 They even have Inca Cola tuk tuk here. Inca Cola! Everybody drink it here. Dos cincuenta. Cincuenta, si? Gracias. Everywhere in the world, in the KFC, in McDonald's, Popeyes, usually like at the meal set, they come with Pepsi, Coca Cola, or. But here in Peru, it come with Inca Cola. Everyone know Cola. It's that brown carbonated soft drink that people love. What is Inca? Inca is an empire. It used to be the largest empire in the pre-Columbian America. A lot of things you see around here is all Inca, 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 Inca. Where we are right now is the Inca capital, Cusco. The most important Inca king. Inca wall over there. Machu Picchu, that one also. Inca runes. And then they have like a lot of Inca runes around in Sacred Valley. Inca language. Quechua. A lot of people still speaking it's actually the third most used language in South America. Now you know Inca is quite a big thing here in Peru. That's why this thing becomes so popular because of the name. Inca Gola. And for some reason, Peruvians love this a lot. They drink it everywhere. Actually, it's not just Peru that has this drink. I've done some research a little bit. Turned out, United States, China, and other countries, they also sell this thing in the supermarket too. In Chile as well, right here. But of course not as popular as in Peru. You see all this whole section of pot here. In Cola has such a small section right here. After two months here in Peru, this is actually my second or third time that I'm having Inca Cola. Honestly, I don't think I like it that much. It's sweet, that's for sure. It's just a little bit of like this lemonade. -y. Some people say it tastes like bubble gum. Some people say it tastes like cream soda. It's sweet and a little bit fruity in itself. So let's see what they have in the ingredients over here. It's carbonated water, sugar, citric acid, caffeine, natural flavors, and other artificials. You have to give it a try yourself because they love it around here. Peruvians love it a lot, this drink. You see like walking on the street, people will drink this. Going to the restaurant and I'm asking like, uh, can I have like some kind of Peruvian drink? The waitress asked me, Inca Cola? So it's literally like a thing here. Yesterday, I have asked my Peruvian amigos basically just want to know why do they love Inca Cola so much. A lot of Peruvian people think that Inca Cola tastes great. It's delicious, it's really good when combined it with the gastronomy of the country. It's the drink of the Incas. Let me zoom in a little bit for you. <laughs> that was quite funny. Give it a try if you ever pass by one. Let me know if you like it, if you don't like it. For now, ciao! Inca Cola kiss. <laughs>